Well, I am at Portland Nursery on Stark Street with Sarah. And Sarah, you know, we're here for Apple Tasting Festival, of course, but you know, it is a great time to plant any kind of plant, and especially fruit trees would be a great idea to put in the ground right now. That is correct. Um, it's my favorite time to plant trees because you don't have to worry about, you know, so much of that deep watering. And um, with our event going on, a lot of people forget that we have plants. <laughs> so we have people here to talk about plants sure. that really know their stuff about fruit trees. Um, and we have a lot of different kinds of fruit trees in stock, not just apples. But what is this one? This one is a Honeycrisp apple, the ever popular, ever expensive <laughs> Honeycrisp apple. And when you're looking at a fruit tree to plant this time of year, you don't want to be looking at the leaves because oh, they're dropping their course. leaves. They're not going to look <laughs> great. Um, but you want to be looking at the branching and the overall structure of the tree. Um, and we have here um, some pruning and planting guides as well. Right, so, that is so helpful. Yeah, and that's on our website as well. And this handout is just one of the many handouts you'll find for plant care and information on our website. Um, definitely, this is the place where we can get you set up with a good um, compost and fertilizer and stakes are important as well. Definitely. I see lots of leaning trees around town. <laughs> um, so definitely come check out the fruit tree selection if you're interested. Right, because you can help us with that besides all the different kinds of apples that you have during this event. Yeah, the benefit of coming during the apple tasting is you can taste what the apples will taste like before you buy it and make the commitment of planting it in <laughs> your so yard. <laughs> um, we don't have all of them, you know, it's not a complete crossover, but we've got about 50 um, varieties to taste and it's just an overall free, fun, family event. Um, what else can we do while we're here? Yeah, we've got um, some live music, we've got uh, fresh cider pressing, hard cider tasting mm. for the adults, caramel apples, um, free kids crafts, which are fun every year. Everybody loves the kid crafts. Um, and scarecrows? We do have a scarecrow contest, yes, thank you. Um, so the submissions are already done, but you could come vote uh, oh, for your fun. favorite scarecrow. And it's just an overall good family festival fall family festival. And then when are the hours and when, when is it all happening? Yeah, so it's this weekend and next weekend, um, 10 to 5. And we are open on Friday, but we don't have all of our vendors and right. events, so. Which is a little bit quieter because Saturday and Sunday can get a little busy, but it's all, any day of those um, days are fun to come to. Yes, my advice is to come early <laughs> <laughs> um, and skip the lines a little bit, but people seem to not be too phased by the lines either. So no, we'll it see. is so much fun. I think it's one of those kickoffs to the fall season. You get to come out with your family and friends and have a wonderful time, eat some apples, and maybe even get an apple tree. So for more information, please go to gardentime.tv. We'll click you over the Portland uh, Nursery website and get all that information to come out and have a great time. Thanks so much. Thank you.